Hey guys, it's me, and this is your first intermission. So what I want you to do is get something to write with, get some paper somewhere, and be ready to challenge your friends. Okay, here's the rules of intermission. The rules will never change. You have five questions. After five questions, you will be given a bonus round. Each of your first five are worth one point. The bonus question is worth two points. Please keep track of your score. The answers will be at the end of the video. All right? All ready? All right, now let's get a 30 second pause and let's go. All right, we're back. Are you ready for round one? Pencil and paper ready. Let's go. In Patton, after George C. Scott faces down the Nazi fighter with nothing more than two revolvers, he almost gets shot, he gets knocked to the ground, and when he gets up, they ask him about what happened, and he said if he could ever find that pilot, he'd give him one of these. Now, the question is, is one of these a kick in the pants? Maybe it's one of these a medal? Or how about a C down here, a trip straight to hell? Make your selection now. You guys ready for round two? Here comes round two. All right. Do you guys remember The Shadow with Alec Baldwin from back in the 90s? Not a horrible remake, but it could have been better. Anyway, The Shadow had many men that he recruited to be this little web of all of his little agents and stuff, and he had a way of talking to them to let him know uh, that they were one of his and vice versa. And they had this little rhyme they would say, and basically, well, it didn't really rhyme, but it said, one guy would say, the sun is shining, and the other guy would say, and it's very hot. How about B over here? But the ice is very slippery. Or how about C over here? Because it casts no shadow. Make your choice. Back when the original Thing came out, the Thing itself was a little different than the remake that came back in the 70s. So James Arness, who played the creature, the Thing itself, his creature form that he was supposed to be, his alien creature form, I should say, was made of what? Was it made of stone, vegetable matter, or human flesh? Make your call. You guys ready for your fourth question? It's an easy one. Get ready. Here's number four. When someone asks you if you are a god, do you say yes? Or do you say no? Or do you just piss your pants? If you don't get this one, you might as well start over. Okay, here's number five coming at you. Last chance before the bonus. Are you ready? Number five. All right, guys, it's number five. The Empire's Veil are a huge amount of douchebags. And so when they capture Princess Leia, they want to know where the rebels are hiding out. And before, you know, they, they, they blow up Alderaan, they ask her one final time, and she tells them a planet. Now, what's that planet's name? Was it Endor? How about Yavin? Or was it Dantooine? This one might make you think a little bit. Alright guys, I know you've been working and you've got your answers at all for the first five, so here's your bonus question for the very first intermission. Alright, now this is going to be a little harder. Bonus question is going to be a little bit more tougher. They're not going to just be something you can sit and just automatically know. You have to be a true fan. Alright, here's your bonus round. In one of the three movies that I talk about constantly but I've never reviewed is called The Touch of Satan. Now, if you've seen The Touch of Satan, I'm sorry. If you haven't seen The Touch of Satan, please don't. But if you have seen it, here's your bonus question, and you guys are going to get the extra two points for this one. All right. One of the biggest jokes about The Touch of Satan is the car that the main hero drives. It's driven throughout the movie, and it's featured prominently probably because they had to deal with the automaker. All right. That car is... A, a Mustang, but B, a Cuda, or C, a Maverick. Hope you guys had fun playing. Hope everybody's having a good time out there. This has been your first if, if you're, if, <laughs> this has been your first intermission, and I am way out of practice. I'm Scotty McClendon. I need a haircut and a really good shave, and I'll be seeing you. Oh yeah, whoa, 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 uh, totally forgot. You guys need the answers, right? Right, okay, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you the answers, 
I, uh, why did that slip my mind? I, I don't know. Just show the answers. You know, it also helped that since we showed you the answers, if we would tell you to please tally up how many points you got. Remember, first five questions are one point. Every bonus question is worth two. Then tally up the points you got, and please post it down below. And uh, see, let's see uh, how much rankings we can get started. Then every week, we will basically tabulate who's got the most points running, and uh, we'll see if this is a little competition or something. Anyway, hope you guys are doing great. Later.